welcome to Dassault Systems 3D Experience Forum in Adelaide, Australia. I'm delighted now to have with me the Business Development Manager of Logicams, Richard Boyko. Richard, good morning. Good morning. Lee. So tell us about your company, Logicams. What do you do? Um, well, Logicams has been around uh, for 25 years now. Um, we're uh, we're a, basically a multidiscipline engineering company. Yeah. Um, I'm part of their uh, technology and innovation group. Um, we're located all across Australia with offices uh, in New Zealand and Papua New Guinea as well. So uh, it's fitting that we're here at this digital forum because the group that I'm part of, the Technology Innovation Group, is all about putting the smarts on top of the engineering that our core business does. So Richard, uh, tell us about some of the challenges facing engineering at the moment. Well, for us, particularly for our organisation, it's been difficult with, over the last few years. Uh, the mining, the oil and gas sector has been hit quite hard. Yeah. Uh, so uh, it's been challenging for us, um, not just for ourselves as an engineering company, but also our customers. Uh, the pressures from our uh, lower cost neighbouring countries has really uh, forced us to look within and, and get a, a lot more efficient. So we're seeing a real trend in digitalisation, doing things smarter, uh, removing those inefficiencies within our business. So digitalisation and what we're all about here today is, 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 is what we're seeing as a big trend. So with those trends though, are they coming fast enough? Because there are some enormous pressures out there across some of those sector, uh, sectors such as mining. Uh, in a way, yes, they are. Um, if, if, you don't, if you're not on the, on the, on the train right now, um, you'll be left behind. And uh, unfortunately, our, as I said, our, our neighbours have got the same expertise, the same technology as we have. So we've just got to get smarter and really digitalisation, removing those inefficiencies is key to all of this and you need to do it. Do you think that all companies are equally as open to the challenges or are there some that are just simply waiting for the tide to turn and things to get better? Yeah, I, look, there's, there's the early adopters that you'll always see and they're the ones that will take advantage of this and they're the ones that you'll, you'll see leap ahead. Those that tend to wait may miss the boat. Yeah. So, um, yeah, certainly um, we're working closely with those early adopters because they, they see the need to change. And what about for you, what about in, in getting and, and keeping a, an appropriately skilled workforce? Is that a challenge? Our workforce is certainly really looking for change, yeah. right? So we've been around for 25 years. We've got systems in place. We're well established. We've done a lot of big projects over the years. And it's getting to the point now where our workforce is looking for the change, yeah. right? So the challenge that we've got is really how do we, how do we get them on that journey? Um, because they've got their habits. So with our organisation, uh, it's having to drive that cultural change to get them to adopt these new systems. Um, and the, uh, the 3D experience platform that everyone will hear about uh, really enables that. And that's what um, we see is, is really the, the change out in the industry. And uh, for our customers as well, they, they can see the value of that. And I'm sure, and particularly if they had the opportunity to be here today and have a look at some of the technology in the 3D playground, it is simply stunning. So hopefully that will be the sort of thing that will really excite them about the future. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm excited. So you know, they're setting up out there and I can't wait to go and put those uh, VR goggles and <laughs> <laughs> walk around and, and see where I end up. So um, I think the, the unique thing about this is that we're able to see a lot of different technology brought together. And I think Dassault Systems, uh, one of the key benefits that we're seeing is that we are able to bring technology from other industries and reapply it to new sectors. And it's, it, I shouldn't say new technology, it's well established and proven technology. So, But I think it's also about having that, that technology and not just seeing it in one sector, but understanding how it can potentially be applied across a, a broad variety of sectors. Yeah, exactly. I totally agree. Um, that's terrific. Richard, thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Thank you.